uh, what makes a television episode truly unforgettable? Is it the plot twists, the characters, or that edge of your seat tension that keeps you glued to your screen? As you dive into the world of House ND, you'll find that it's a unique blend of all these elements, especially in its most anxiety-inducing episodes. Uh, before we delve deeper, please consider subscribing and hitting the like button for more content like this. A uh, little support goes a long way. House captivatingly weaves together stories of medical drama and personal struggles. The show's protagonist, Dr. Gregory House, plays a brilliant yet flawed physician whose knack for solving rare cases comes at a price, often leading to distressing outcomes. Uh, one episode that illustrates this beautifully is birthmarks. Here, the typically slow-paced narrative is thick with tension as House confronts the impact of his father's death, paralleling a patient's quest for her biological parents. The emotional intensity resonates, tapping into universal themes of family and loss. And then what happens to do is wrongs to see, you know, make hip hips film about the Colify. Um, but now you also have uh, a mineral ability to build a Colify in the face of this suspense feels heavy with impending doom. The suspense peaks when the team races against time, only to realize a heartbreaking failure lingers overhead. On a different note, Detox takes us inside House's battle with his addiction. Although it may seem less intense on the surface, the portrayal of his withdrawal symptoms gripped viewers in a psychological stranglehold, exposing the depth of this struggle with pain and dependency. An airborne adds another layer of distress as a mysterious illness begins to spread on a plane. A claustrophobic environment amplifies the stakes reminding us of recent real-world fears. Through it all, House and Cuddy navigate the chaos with resourcefulness, showcasing their resilience against mounting pressure. And as House's story progresses, we arrive at Broken, a stark exploration of addiction's aftermath. Plagued by withdrawal, the episode offers a raw look at recovery. House's denial of needing mental health support is both saddening and relatable embodying the complexity of healing. And then comes nobody's fault, where a patient's violent outburst leads to a life-threatening situation for a vital team member. The intertwining subplots raise questions of blame, survival, and the frailty of life, keeping viewers on high alert throughout the episode. Number two, a later of God's Scardish. Call increase and faster of graze of bow fall of God. Wilson's heart delivers emotional turmoil as the fate of a beloved character hangs in the balance. The unfolding drama not only tests House's limits, but also threatens to fracture his closest friendships, taking viewers through a roller coaster of feelings. Because House's head stands out with a disorienting narrative that keeps audiences decent. The flashbacks juxtaposed with present day urgency create a sense of dread as House tries to piece together a critical memory that could save a life. And this, among the most heart-stopping installments, both sides now, captures the essence of despair through House's drug-induced hallucinations. The last ten minutes unravel his grip on reality, leaving fans shaken as they witness his struggle unfold in such raw and vivid imagery. And also, finally, Last Resort found encapsulates the series' most frantic moments. A hostage crisis escalates rapid moral questions about health care, accessibility. The frantic pacing and emotional weight make this episode a standout, illustrating how desperation can lead to drastic choices. Uh, life in the hospital can be chaotic, puzzling, and often darkly humorous. Much like Dr. House himself, after all, he's the kind of guy who would probably say that his definition of a good time is diagnosing people to avoid his own problems. And with that said, thanks for watching, and until next time.